Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lexi and I am the owner of Jasper Lane and it is basically a design company for your everyday life, which is Jasper Lane and my new rental company, which is Lane Studios. It's all under the Jasper Lane branch, but it's separated onto two Instagrams because it helps my brain function better that way. Um, so in this video, we are going to be making over my boyfriend's apartment and <laughs> I, I was so happy to do this um, because I told him that I was going to do this. He likes mid-century modern. He's He doesn't like to ca call himself a hipster, but he is sort of a hipster because um, he has his own like coffee bar. We made that for him and he has a record player and he likes the dark wood and the mid-century modern. We didn't really decorate his room, so we didn't really decorate and film any of that. We made a lot of wood pieces for his project. We made a wooden coffee table and we made a wooden um, record player table, record table holder thing. Um, we don't really have a name for it, obviously, because that did not fall off the tongue very smoothly. Um, but that will be shown later in the video. And if you did not also know that the wooden products are under a wooded lane branch of Jasper Lane, they don't get too much love on here because we are just running around. So if you want to stay and watch to the end for the new uh console table record player table and watch it i swear it'll be worth the wait it was so fun to be able to make this for connor and i think it looks perfect and it fit everything that he needed and he has an extensive record collection All right, so let's look at the place before. Um, it's a one bedroom apartment. It's a good space for like a one person. Like it um, is kind of small, but like I said, it's a good space for one person. He doesn't need much space. He actually has a cute little corner for his like work area. So he doesn't have to work in the living room or in the um, his bedroom or on the dining table. Like he doesn't have to work in that stuff. So, but yeah, this is the before. Um, there was a lot of junk in here before and we had it all removed, all taken out. He kept a few things from the previous people or the people who rent out the space. Um, but other than that, we brought mostly everything in. <laughs> um, hello, we are shopping today for Connor's apartment and today we are thrifting for some furniture for him to kind of fill up his new apartment. Um, he's not a big fan of thrifting. So what? we- said that? <laughs> you and like every other video probably yep. um but today we are gonna thrift and see if what we can find for him it's me him and his mom are going his mom loves to thrift too so it's two against one haha -ha. um but yeah so we're gonna show you we're at honey brothers right now getting coffee and then we're gonna start thrifting and then if we don't find anything thrifting we're gonna go to target and ikea and whatever too so Okay, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. All right, so we found this chair. We like it for the corner where the TV's gonna be on that wall. $15. It's nice and leather and it's just like extra seating without being like an ugly fold out chair. You like it. Cute. Thank you. <laughs> All right, the first thrift store down, and I don't know how many more we're going to, or if we're going to Target, or what next. I know we're having an Ikea trip planned. We don't have one here in Louisville, so we're gonna go to Cincinnati, I think, next weekend to look, and then we will go from there. All right, it's kind of bright, but we're about to go into Ikea to get the rest of his furniture, and by the rest of furniture, I mean all of his furniture. All of the furniture. <laughs> All of the furniture so this is only my second time in ikea i went when i did the 24-hour room makeover this is michelle this is connor's mom Hi. <laughs> oh, sorry that's come for safety um i the last time i went to ikea and the only other time i went was for the 24-hour charlotte apartment makeover with my friend Haley. so Haley, i miss you if you're watching this but let's see what we can find hopefully everything because i'm already tired of shopping <laughs> saw this one online and really likes it. He says it's comfortable, so it's good so far. We have all these to do, all these to look at. So many couches. Okay, so we like this color, but for on a couch, the gray one over there. 
but this is the color that we like. All right, so after we did a lot of shopping, we installed a lot of these floating shelves. Now they don't, they aren't really floating shelves because there are um, the little brackets, but we stained a bunch of the shelves and we hung them up so he could put a lot of his cool movie posters or sp sports posters or music posters up on the wall. So we did a fun little install and we did film that. We didn't film, I didn't film the last install, but guys, I filmed this install for you. It's chaotic, but we filmed it. Okay, so Connor has a lot of posters, so we wanna utilize that for decorations. So these are the ones that we're gonna use. We're gonna find frames for them. They're like the coolest ones. And we're gonna put those behind the couch. These over here, they're like some soccer ones. They're gonna go up on this wall. And there's gonna be some shelves, like two shelves here. We're gonna have four posters and then just decorate it. So hopefully that's good. We gotta get frames for all of them, probably black frames. Okay, we finally got some picture frames. So they're just really simple and black for these soccer posters. He's got five of these, so we wanted them all to be the same because they're all, at least four of them are gonna go up on this wall over here. Here's a little tip if your poster is too small compared to the frame because somebody has very weird shaped or weird sized posters. So this is a little smaller than this. So there's a little bit of white, but I'm gonna show you a little trick that I do so you don't get the back end of the, like the cardboard. So it looks a little bit cleaner. So I don't know how to show this on camera. Why are you <laughs> staring at me? Sorry. <laughs> okay, so you wanna line it up as centered as you can. You can use tape if you want, but I'm not going to on these posters because I don't want to rip the posters. So you want to center it. There's a little bit of gap here and a little bit of a gap there. And then you want to take the sheet that it came with. It's a white on the back. So you want to put the white side facing down so then that is like the border around the poster. And then it fits. All right guys, so this is what you've been waiting for, the record player table, console table, whatever, the reveal. I was so excited to make this for him. I think it looks absolutely awesome in his apartment. Um, we put a little shelf above it so we can show off the records that he's currently listening to. And I just love how it turns out. It's a new style, obviously, because we have not done a record player holder before. 
and it is a new color so if you have seen me in the past i know with the officiant office makeover we did a coffee table and that was pine but this one is a dark jacobean stained color it is perfect it's like very mid-century modern it's very dark it's very it just fits connor's apartment perfectly i don't really know how else to say it if it's a style and we use that color all throughout on the coffee table the record table and the shelves i I am so excited to show you what it looks like now. Alright guys, thank you so so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed making it for you. I know Connor loves the apartment. I hope you guys love the apartment. I love the apartment. He doesn't want to leave it. We will see about that. Whenever he does move, we will be making over again. Don't you worry, but I don't think he'll be moving anytime soon. But again, thank you for watching and be sure to follow me on all the social medias to stay updated with what I'm creating, all my projects that I'm working on, and all the events that I'm styling. I cannot wait to take you guys along on the journey with me and thank you for following along so far. Um, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Hopefully in a different shirt. Bye.